So basically I've been writing now for about five, six years and um, closing in on roughly three million words, uh, almost a million of which were written during the pandemic. Um, I, I think a big part of that drafting success is devices like this. The ability to sort of focus in on just word generation and not thinking about editing or revising or any of those sorts of things. So I'm going to take a few seconds today to talk about the, the free write, uh, especially this, the older unit, the original unit, uh, sort of explain how it works and uh, what the real benefit is uh, for somebody like me. Okay, so the device itself is really reminiscent of a typewriter. It has sort of that same uh, angled design. Uh, it's kind of got that same uh, sort of uh, thicker in the back, thinner in the front look. It does use a, uh, a full mechanical keyboard. So these are, uh, I believe, uh, MX style switches, uh, mechanical switches, I think brown or clear or something like that. For those of you who are into mechanical keyboards, it has that sort of, that nice, tactile feel, but without being super clicky. Um, the uh, bulk of the unit is really controlled by a keystroke combinations as well as these two toggle knobs. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, power the unit on and we'll talk briefly about how this works. So you see the screensaver disappears and I have sort of these dual bezels. The top bezel would be where I would do my writing. The bottom bezel would give me some sort of status indication. And as you can see, I've got a couple of different options here I can toggle through you know clocks and word counts and dates and the amount of time versus you know nothing an email address etc so it gives us a couple of different options as far as that's concerned the overall experience is you know roughly like using any kind of a word processor um, it's not difficult uh, it's not difficult to use it's not um, hard to uh, to work with What's nice about it is, of course, I'm going to type something and then it automatically synchronizes to, in my case, Dropbox, but in your case, one of the other maybe uh, cloud providers. Adding in uh, new documents is as simple as double punching these two red buttons here at the bottom. Um, right now, I have the Wi-Fi switched to off, but switching it to on would, of course, allow it to hook to the Wi-Fi here at the, uh, in the home office and it would synchronize my documents pretty much as I go, or I can toggle it over to new and pick the appropriate uh, wireless network. Folders A, B, and C are really just that simple A, meaning any document you write in the A folder would end up in the A folder on the, their website, as well as in Dropbox, the B and C, you know, this works the same accordingly. I think the thing you really have to focus on when you're looking at a device like this is what it does for your sort of thought processes. Uh, I was writing for a while before word processors and there is a tendency to get stuck, right? We get stuck and then we wanna go quickly look up something on the internet or take a few seconds to review a document or look at a picture of something or get some ideas. And you know, it sounds great in theory until you go do that. And then you look at the clock and 15 minutes have elapsed and you've gone you know, 10, 15 clicks deep and you didn't mean to. So what's nice about a device like this is it forces me to, to come up with a word count goal. You know, I, I typically try to write about 1500 words at a pop, come up with that goal and then start clocking in time against that goal. And there's no, there's no distraction. There's no desire to go look at something else or bring some other item up because we have everything I need right in front of me, I just keep typing. I don't spend a lot of time backspacing, correcting things, etc. I just keep moving forward. And I think that's the key with a device like this is just keep moving forward, right? That's what you want to be able to do. You want to generate words. We can always clean up words later in other applications. That's what other applications are for. This is for drafting. So uh, yeah, the original free write, it's, um, it's definitely uh, heavy and metal and feels like a typewriter, uh, but it gives you that experience of being able to, uh, to forward focus, to focus in on drafting and not get lost in the weeds of uh, perhaps looking up or, uh, or responding to email or Twitter or the like. So this gives you kind of a, a quick, quick and dirty overview as to what the, uh, the original device looks like um, from uh, Astro House uh, and why I think it's useful.